morning. Hey guys and girls and gals and everyone in between. Welcome to an ooky spooky Roger Reacts. Now, when I did Roger Reviews, I was like, I wish I called it Roger Reacts. So now, I'm just gonna take that and spin it into his own little series. And I'm gonna start with everything f***ed up. Grizzly Tales for Grissom Kids. I remember this as a kid. I remember it being disturbing and thinking, what the f*** am I watching? Who? Whose parents let me watch this? I'm not entirely sure how this is gonna turn out because I've not watched these beforehand. So this can make for great entertainment or it could be absolutely terrible. I might end up just staring and loving it. I might also get hungry and wanna eat worms. Who knows? But make sure to subscribe right now if you already haven't and make sure you've got the HD version. Make sure the quality is as high as possible. I didn't put all this UV light and then UV makeup on for you not to see it all, honey. Why do I feel icky spooky? I'm like totally channeling like whiplash. Whiplash is, oh, sexy. I'm totally channeling that. That's literally what's happening right now. That is happening. I might start taking inspiration from the title of these episodes and do a few of them. Maybe I'll do a look inspired by the episode for when I watch it. Watch me do an entire look in geesh, pure icky spooky for one of these episodes and it was absolutely terrible. Maybe that's not a good idea. Maybe I should get someone to watch it beforehand. Maybe, maybe I need a researcher. I need a researcher. Babbling, you know me, love a babble. Babble the bop, babble on. I'm just gonna go ahead and hit play, so let's react to the oogie spooky. Grizzly tales for gruesome kids. The dragon moth. <laughs> what is going on? Is this the intro? Grizzly tales. Yeah, oh, love that noise. It would appear that some of the naughty children were scared of me. I can't think why. May I dried my hands on the back of their hair, I wonder. Or the funny little habit I have of clearing my throat onto my guest's toothbrushes. Oh. Here's your toothbrush. <laughs> this is too much already, this is too much. Does anyone do their health? He, he was do. a sign painter. Well, he always ignored the sign that said, Children must wait here, which is why the headmistress chained him to the wall like a dotted Just imagine as a concert, your teacher shackling you to the wall. I think I can feel my brain. My oh, father, signs are there to keep you safe. I love that it's the same man voicing every character. <laughs> Nudger Nicholson. Five. Is a sign that says, "Here be dragons." That's one sign I'd like to see. That is one sign uh, you will never see. What? Here be thy dragons. <laughs> freshly painted sign on the end of his bed. Do not go to the light. Electricity kills and danger trains. That train looks like one of them bullets from Mario. Where the deserted lighthouse glowed white like a boiled bone. Boiled bone. What does a boiled bone look like? Come no closer. Go home. <laughs> Me and drag Eat to everyone. <laughs> hanging over his head, the sign. Here be dragons. And there, the shadow stretched across the sea. The oh. beast was awake in its lair. Release the beast. Baby! The door crashed open. What a cast iron fool I am! A little bit in mock! That's TV goals! That is TV goals! Uh, I like his stuff. Stash that booty. That was magic. I'm not really the dragon master. I'm 
I love that even though the beard is off, it still has a little line where his mouth was. That is some nose. Power bottoms when someone says they're hung. Oh, plot twist. Yeah, and I was gonna scram you. Oh, yeah, because moths like light. Oh, look at them arms. Work, sis. What a fashion icon. Take me heat. I didn't. Garlic butter. Um, the fact that they literally showed you the moth dropping him and saying he fell on rocks. Surely some sort of child has the imagination to think, hmm, I wonder what will happen to a little boy if he's dropped on a cliff or dropped on shards of rock, big boulders. What would happen to him? I'm like, Surely that's disturbed some sort of kids. They're being told to picture death of being dropped at a high height onto boulders. Hello? I think I was kind of more just baffled by it and like what the fuck is going on. I think the only gruesome part was imagining the little boy's death, which... That should be a lot for a child. Oh, we're getting a little shoulder action. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a like and comment if you want me to do another one or if you want to see me react to something specific, comment down below, send me a DM over on Instagram or Twitter, that's at Roger Wittigy. Let me know what you want to see me react to because I'm going to definitely keep this series going. I had fun. Let me find some weird, send me your weirdest randomest video, something like salad fingered or something really disturbing for me to react to. Send me stuff. I will do an entire day of filming Roger Reacts. Let me know what you want to see. Or if you want to see me react to a David Attenborough video, go for it. That would, imagine, reacting to David Attenborough, a horror sketch, a comedy sketch. That could work. A complete discombobulation of reactions. Babbling. I gotta go now, but make sure you like and subscribe if you haven't already. Stay safe and spread kindness. Mwah, see you soon.